You're watching Soulful Discussions. All right, so hi, how are you doing today? Yeah, I'm pretty good, thank you. Right, kind of right. tired. Absolutely, I just yeah, finished. Through running. Yeah, right? <laughs> yeah. Uh, so I approached you about doing an interview for my YouTube. Do you remember what the topics were? I gave you three topics. Uh, tell me about it. Okay, so it's uh, your thoughts about the subject of feet, mental health, oh, okay, reflexology, okay? okay? Uh, let me ask you this. When you hear the word feet, what do you think about first? First thing you think about? Feet, like doing exercise. You think about exercise. Yeah. Run, running. You're yeah. just running and stuff right. like that. Okay. Yeah. Um, we're going to ask you some questions today. It'll be your thoughts. Just feel free to answer however you like, okay? Okay. All right. What about mental health? When you hear that, what do you think about? Like mental health, like take care about myself. Absolutely. Um, what else? Uh, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Uh, some people think about anxiety, stress, things like yeah, that. Yeah. Okay. Um, for example, yesterday, I have exciting. Okay. So yesterday, I was kind of bad day for me because oh, wow. I was whole day crying. Oh, no. Yeah, and then I was just like in the press. Wow. So today that. is like. Today's a new day. Yeah, right? Absolutely. That's good. Yeah. You're out running, the sun shines out. Right? That's good. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, today we're going to talk a little bit about dealing with stress and anxiety, some tips that maybe you have for other people, and then I'll also give you some information, okay? Okay. Uh, what about reflexology? Have you ever heard of that before? Uh, no. No? Okay, don't worry. I'm going to give you some information today, and then you can just tell me what your thoughts are about that once I tell you, okay? Okay. Cool. Let's start with the first question. What is something that you think we can do to improve mental health awareness around the world? Like, what can we do? Um, go out, like okay. walk. Okay. So go out walk. Things like healthy for yourself. Okay. Mm -hmm. Things that are healthy, like yeah. helping to unclog the mental space, right? Yeah. Absolutely. And then, um, also, I will say like, all depends about your people around oh, you. The the, yeah, 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 yeah. Absolutely. Right. So making sure that you have a good friends. Group of people. Yeah. Absolutely. That's really good. I like that one. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Um, in terms of this question, fill in the blank. Okay. The world would be better if. I, um, wow, that was a good That's question. A good one? <laughs> yeah. If we don't care about like material, material things, material things, or too too much about money. Absolutely, I think right? those are really good ones. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. I know money is. Yeah. Your, you need it to yeah. buy things, but it's not everything. Right. right? Absolutely. Yeah. Um, if a friend or a loved one was uh, dealing with like stress or anxiety. Is there anything you would say or do with them to like help them out? I can, you can try to help them, but yeah. um, they have to decide yeah. to True. to let, let them like help. Yeah, absolutely. You yeah, know? you can't just, yeah, you can say whatever you want, but until they are ready, yeah. it's not going to happen. Absolutely. Right. Absolutely. Um, in terms of anxiety, right? With this question, don't go, you don't have to go too in depth, just a surface of You might, okay? you're going to make me cry. <laughs> When you is there anything that brings you anxiety, and if so, when you feel anxiety happening, do you do anything to like get out of that? Oh, well, I start crying, okay. like just like let it go, let Absolutely. it go. Yeah, yeah, that's a good one. You know what somebody told me once? They said that um, salt water, like, oh. purges everything. Mm -hmm. So they said like stuff at the ocean, like the ocean water, like it cleans the bottom of the ocean. Like when you cry, like right. It's For like example, yesterday I was at work. Yeah. So that happened to me in work. Uh huh. And then I was like, "What am I gonna do?" I start like, I feel scared, like afraid. Yeah. I don't know. And then I start crying. I go to the ba the restroom, uh -huh. and I was just sitting there, like crying, and I was like, "Okay, relax. Yeah. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe and in. That's yeah. It. Just calm down. Yeah. Absolutely. That's a really good one. Thanks. Um. If you could change one thing about yourself, right? And it doesn't have to be something physical, but just in general. Is there anything you would change? My thoughts. Your thoughts? So yeah. how you think at certain moments? Yeah. Okay. I, cool. I always overthinking. Is that right? Yeah. Okay. Well, it's glad that you ran into me today because I'm going to give you some information about not trying to overthink, okay? Okay. <laughs> Absolutely. Um, okay, let's get into these questions now. When I fill in the blank on this question, okay? When I think about my feet, I feel... How do you feel when you think about your feet? more uh, confident confident okay yeah because yeah, they take you everywhere mm -hmm. right foundation like you were just running so like yeah. without your feet you couldn't do anything really right <laughs> so it's a very important thing um let me ask you this have you ever received compliments about your feet has anybody ever said to you hey i think you have nice feet <laughs> thank you no nobody's ever said that L let's say somebody well some sometimes somebody yeah. has. <laughs> yeah how did you feel when they complimented you 
I don't know where because I I don't listen to those um, words like more often. Oh, okay, so you don't give so, them a lot. So, you so I was just like kind of shy. Oh, okay. I don't know. Okay, so in terms of that, like if com somebody compliments you about your hair, do you feel the same way? Like somebody says, "Hey, you have nice hair." I'm like, "Oh, thank you." <laughs> <laughs> so that was different. Yeah. Oh, okay. Absolutely. Cool. Cool. Um, let me ask you this. In terms of when you get compliments from men and women, do you prefer to get compliments more from men or women? I mean, uh, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Same? Yeah, it's the, it's the same. same. Some people say well, it's different. Well, so, yeah, for the men, oh, so, okay. of course. <laughs> it's like I'm, I'm trying to get guys. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. Mm -hmm. um, in terms of compliments that you do get, right, is there a certain compliment that when you hear it, you're like, man, that really made me feel good. That made my day. Yeah. Which one is it? I mean, like, you, you look good. You look, you look pretty, you look today. pretty. Yeah. Okay. Something like that. Nice, nice. Yeah. So, like, if you, you just put on a good dress and you got your hair done and everything. You look good. You wow. You I'm good. impressed. Something like that. That's dope. That's yeah. That's dope. Okay. Um, how often do you get pedicures? Sorry? How often do you get pedicures? Ooh. Not often? No. Not often? Um, have you ever heard of a medical pedicure? No. Never? Okay, so a medical pedicure is when you go see a podiatrist, a uh, specialist of the foot, right? Mm -hmm. They look at your feet to make sure, like, uh, your toenails grow correctly. They make sure your toe alignment is good. Um, they check your feet for, like, dead skin, fungus, do all the work there with, like, medical-grade equipment. Maybe because I don't grow up with those things, yeah, yeah, so yeah. I was like, okay, I'm just going to cut my... You do it yourself. Yeah, <laughs> yeah absolutely. But this is, like, um, probably, like, the cleanest possible pedicure you could get. It's not like going to the nail salon. Oh, and just is that different? Absolutely, it's different. Oh, okay. Absolutely. How would you feel about seeing somebody like that who could like I'm, tell you I'm about your I'm pretty curious right now. You would, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Um, how often do you wear open toe shoes, sandals, flip flops, things like that? How? How often? Oh, like every day in my just in my house. In your house? Yeah. Okay. Um, what's your favorite type of shoe to wear? I have in my car. Let me show you. Oh, okay. Cool, okay? cool, cool, cool. Favorites? Yeah, this is my favorite. These are our favorite shoes right here. Yeah. Absolutely. And what are these? What are they called? I don't know. <laughs> oh, you don't know? But you just like how they feel? Yeah, it's comfortable. Okay. Yeah. Nice, nice. Um, how often do you go barefoot? No shoes. No shoes? Yeah. Mm, not really. Not really? No. Not even at home? Like you don't go barefoot? No, I always always wear, wear, okay. Yeah. What about like at the beach? At a park? Well, at the beach. Yeah, at the of beach, course. Yeah. What about a park? At the park? No. No, why not? Well, when I was kid, of course, well, uh, yeah. <laughs> right now, I don't know, like... What's in the grass? <laughs> well, so let me ask you this. Uh, let's say that you got your blanket out, you know, you're under a nice tree, you brought your favorite book, you got some snacks. Do you have your shoes on or shoes off? Shoes off. Shoes off. Yeah, mm -hmm. you got to relax, right? right? Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. All right, so now, in this moment right now, can we see what your feet look like? My feet? Uh-huh. <gasps> yes. <laughs> <laughs> Take a deep breath. All right, cool. Let me have you. What size? Oh, leave your socks on for now. Leave your socks on. Okay. Um, just take both shoes off. Um, what size shoe do you wear? Sorry. What size shoe do you wear? Uh, uh seven. Seven. Okay. Yeah. Does it vary depending on the type of shoe? Like if you're wearing a sandal or sometimes. Heel? Sometimes it's yeah. different. Okay. Cool. Let me have you turn this way and then just place place your feet here. <laughs> okay. And it looks like your big toe is bigger than your rest of your toes, right? Yeah. It's longer. Okay. Do you know what that's called? No. Okay. It's called an Egyptian toe alignment. So there's different types of toe alignments. They're called different things. If your second toe is bigger, it's called a Grecian, a Greek toe. Okay. Absolutely. So there's different ones. You have the Egyptian. Okay. Let me have you extend your legs out straight like that. Okay. And then toes up. Like flex your toes up like that. There you go. All right. Cool. And then you can take your socks off now. <laughs> oh, I, can't, I just get it. Can't, so, so I can't reach. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Absolutely. All right. And then place them down flat first. Flat like this. Okay. All right. And you're keeping them natural right now, I'm guessing, right? <laughs> Absolutely. When's the last time you had a picture? Uh, like a month ago. Like a month ago? Yeah. Okay. How, how often do you go? Like once, twice? Once. One. Once or twice? Yeah. Like, probably when you feel like going, right? Absolutely. All right. Cool. I'm going to have you extend out again. Do this. All right. Cool. And then how are you feeling right now? How are you feeling in this moment? You feel comfortable? You feel yeah. Comfortable? I feel okay. relaxed. Cool. Cool. Yeah. You guys got to run it, so I'm pretty yeah. sure it feels good right now. Right? Absolutely. 
Leave your feet out. We're going to go through a couple more exercises. Okay? okay. But let me tell you why I got started with my channel. Okay. So during uh, quarantine, right, I was watching another guy's channel and he was talking about um, exposure therapy. Okay. Have you ever heard of that before? No. So exposure therapies for like, let's say, for example, you feel uncomfortable in certain like situations or maybe you have a phobia or a fear or something. Okay. Right. If you wanted to get over that, let's say like you have a fear of approaching strangers, like you don't like to go up and talk to people, right? Therapists will tell you, go up and do it. Do it over and, and over, over again, right? Yeah. So that you can get used to how it feels. So you're going to learn like, oh, I feel uncomfortable, but nothing bad is happening. So it's okay for me to do that, right? So when I heard about that, I'm like, I overthink every situation, right? Situations that come up, I can sit there and think about it for a long time. And then the situation is gone. <laughs> it's no time. So I was like, I want to get better at making just yeah. snap decisions, right? Like, so yeah, exactly. Quickly. Exactly. So I basically had the idea. I was like, what if I took exposure therapy, right? Interviewing women about how they feel about their feet and put them together to see what type of reactions I get, right? And so sometimes women are like, yes, they're, they're cool, they're open. Some women are like, I don't know. And some women are like, absolutely not. Oh, but really? The whole, the whole point of my channel is just to get different reactions to see how people feel about it, to see who's comfortable and who's not comfortable about it. What do you think about me? <laughs> you seem to be I very was... comfortable. Yeah, yeah, yeah you're okay. very comfortable, absolutely. So what do you think about that? How do you feel about like what my channel is trying to do? You think that's a good thing? or? Yeah. I I really like it. Absolutely. I'm going to follow you. <laughs> Absolutely. I appreciate that. Absolutely. So let's talk a little about reflexology, okay? And then I'll let you get out of here, okay? Okay. So reflexology is all about the different uh, pressure points you have in your hands and in your feet, right? Those right. pressure points actually, like, connect to different parts of your body. So let's say, for example, through, like, if you go get a massage, acupuncture, acupressure, you can alleviate, like, the tension that you feel in moments of stress, right? So I don't know if you deal with migraines, but... For people who deal with migraines, there's actually a portion of your hands and your feet you can massage that alleviates how you feel in that moment. Oh, yeah. wow. There's also a piercing you can get in your ear does the same thing. What are your thoughts about that? How do you feel about that? you think it's a good thing? What do you think? That's a good thing. It's a good thing? Yeah. Absolutely. Have you ever gone out and gotten a massage where they target different areas? Uh, only on my face. Only on your face? Yeah. You should think about on your hands and your feet too because it could like really be something that's beneficial for you. Absolutely. I will try. Absolutely. Yeah. So when we get to this portion, we like to talk about sensitivity, right? How ticklish do you tend to be? Hmm. Like when you get pedicures, are you like, like really like ticklish, or are you how, how, do, how are you in those? Moments? No, I'm I'm good. You yeah, really cool. Ticklish? Yeah. Okay. Do you mind if we test it on camera to like see? Like I have a tool to use. Is that cool? Yeah, sure. All right, cool. Hold that first one second. All right, cool. Both feet here. Okay. And then let me just. I just wipe your feet off just a little oh, bit. Oh, sorry. That's no, okay. No, you're good. You're good. I'm just get the sand off a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> All right, cool. All right. And then just tell me which foot you feel it on the most, okay? Yeah. Here we go. You ready? Yeah. All right. One, two, three. And then where do you feel it at the most? Uh, Is that the top, the middle, the bottom? I just feel like it's relaxed. It feels relaxed? It's yeah. like a massage? That's good. That's yeah. good. Okay, let's try here, okay? This one's more sensitive. I can see you move. <laughs> Where do you feel it at the most? Like here in the middle? Let's see, close a little bit. Okay. And so, what's the scale? One out of ten. Leave it for you. Oh. What's what's your uh, what's the scale? One out of ten. Um. On this one, it's a what? Like. Maybe like a two or a three. Yeah. Okay. This one. Like five, five six. Five or six. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Here's what I want you to do. Leave it for you. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Leave it for you. I want you to wiggle your toes while I'm doing it. You tell me if you feel it more or less, okay? okay. Ready? All right, wiggle, do this. More or less? <laughs> you feel it less or more? Uh, I don't feel like... You don't feel it at all, right? Yeah. Do you know why? No. Okay, so... Leave it. <laughs> so I got this idea. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So basically, because your mind is telling your feet to like move right oh. you can't feel what it feels like in that area but also because you're moving your toes it moves the energy from spot to spot so like it's something that beneficial that you can do like to help out so if you go get pedicures you're ticklish just do this a little bit okay, okay? cool okay, yeah. send your feet out one more time we're gonna have you do some exercises this is the test of dexterity and flexibility in your feet okay okay let me get you bend your toes over make a fist tell me if you feel pain or discomfort just do this is that easy to do or hard to do easy easy okay relax spread your toes tell me if you feel pain or discomfort easy yeah. Oh, it's pretty good. Do you yoga or anything? No. no? Okay, cool. Lastly, just wiggle your toes for 10 seconds. Tell me pain, discomfort, cramping, anything. Easy? Yeah. Okay. I think so. Yeah. Cool. There right. it is. All right. I'm cool. Wait, now you're ready. Now you can put your feet down. <laughs> okay. 
All right. I don't uh, want. <laughs> I won't now. Uh, let me ask you this: in terms of my approach to you, right? When I came up, did you feel my approach was good? Was it bad? How'd you feel about it? I feel like um, comfortable. Comfortable. Really? Okay. Yeah. I didn't feel like. I didn't come up aggressive or anything. No, 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 no. Okay. Thank you so much. Yeah. In terms of uh, the interview from start to finish, right? Could you see how everything was going in the line? Did it make sense? Did you learn anything new? Everything. Everything? Did <laughs> yeah. you learn something new? Yeah, of course. Absolutely. Good, yeah. good. Thank you. Uh, the last thing I always ask, something you can say to my channel. Maybe it's something you learned in life. Maybe somebody gave you some advice about something. Something you could say that could be helpful. Guys, like, like and subscribe on this guy. <laughs> I love it. I love it, man. She would have different. Right? <laughs> Thank you so much. We definitely appreciate you coming Thank out you. doing this with us. And we hope you have a great one, okay? Thank you, Joshua. All right.